Hey guys, I've been promising you this office tour for a long time now. So we just bought a four bedroom house and we currently are pregnant with our first so we don't need all those rooms for children yet. So um, this front bedroom is designated as the office and I'm not going to show you the half that's my husband's stuff but I'll show you the half that's my stuff uh, because I'm pretty happy with my new desk and my setup and uh, you might be curious because you've been seeing it in the background of my videos as to what it looks like. So you come in through the door um, and this closet here, hi, um, has just sort of craft supplies and things in there. Um, it's mirrored so that's fun. This poster uh, my husband found for me at Comic-Con a couple years ago and so that's just hanging on that wall there. This painting here was done for me as a gift from my brother. It's, uh, if you can't tell, that's Gladys from the, and, and Shell from the video game portal. And uh, I think it's amazing. And it's up here. And this is my whole desk setup. I got this IKEA desk. Um, now I'm forgetting already what it's called, Linmon, I believe, with two N's and maybe a couple M's, I don't know. Um, but it is like, seven feet long I think basically it's, it's like seven no that's not right a little bit less it's like 70 something inches um, and so if you look at my previous desk setup tour video you'll see that I was on this tiny little desk um, and I had room for like my computer but not even really my monitor that was mounted on the wall um, and if I ever wanted to do anything else like filming or sewing I had to clear off my desk and it was kind of a pain, so I really wanted to be able to spread out now that we have more room. So let's move from this side. I've got my computer here. I moved it up onto the desk so it'll hopefully get less um, dusty. Someday I'd like to get a new case because some of these, uh, like my headphone jack here and this USB port have been giving me trouble. Um, and I'm kind of tired of it's all red lit in there when it's on. But uh, that's not important. <laughs> let's see. This is connected to my speakers and so that's where I plug in my headphones when I'm using them and these are the speakers and then the subwoofers down below um, then let's see yeah my monitor my keyboard you've seen those before um, then this side has drawers this is just a sticky note with some brain dumping stuff that I have to process um, I haven't finished like filling all of these drawers with everything that I want to yet or like organizing them at all but um, here's what we've got so far. This has like some spare field notes. It's got my little, I should put this up on the shelf actually, my little Lego um, Quinjet. Got some USB, uh, flash drive, MP3 player I never use, some batteries, <laughs> cables, stuff like that. Um, this is a pencil case that I probably should use but I'm not using. The box for my, um, my Pilot Metropolitan which is actually up there. This came with my headphones, but like I don't, I don't know, go out and about and bring my headphones with me too much, so I don't really use it, but it's like a little case. Sticky notes, paper, um, this is the field note insert I'm going to be using for like starting next week because I've filled up my current one. This is the USB um, card reader that I use to transfer files from my camera to either my phone or my computer. It's pretty fancy. And then I've been playing around with watercolors. So that's just the basic set. This one has only things in it that uh, are kind of hiding in the back. My set of dice from when we play D&D, which we haven't in months. Flashlight. Uh, this is my like foreign coin collection in the back there. And then my collection of chocolate frog cards from Universal Studios. A couple user's manuals and stuff in there. This drawer has sort of a stack of papers I need to deal with. This is where all my washi tape lives. I'm going to try to find a better way to maybe put that in the top drawer. Um, this is my craft knife, and then this has like my stickers, corner rounder, the pair of scissors, more post-it notes, stuff like that. Uh, this drawer currently only has tax paperwork, so I'm not even going to show you. And then this drawer just has my camera's bag and the wheels that could go on this uh, set of drawers, but are not on there. So that's cool having the drawers there and then I still also have my plastic drawers over here. I've mostly been sort of sorting things out of there over to there and then maybe I can put more craft supplies on this side. 
Um, those are some nail supplies, stuff I need to find a place for, my sewing kit and my laptop bag. Then up here we've got this um, mount for my microphone. This is a Christmas gift as was the shock mount here. So this keeps things from um, like vibrations from affecting the microphone quite as much because it's mounted on these like el elastic guys. And so I'm able to sort of move this over so when I'm over here, this is where I film my videos. And I'm actually, I have the camera mounted up on this tripod just pointing straight down. So that works really well. And then I can move the whole microphone over to this side when I am filming my Sims videos. Or when I'm like, you know, web chatting or whatever, because I do have a webcam there. Um, let's see, that's just the uh, calendar, my wand from Universal. This is the same pen holder or whatever organizer thing that um, Cindy Gunter Balta uses and I found it on Amazon because she linked it once or twice and I just think it's really cute and I'm able to have like all my different pens uh, sorted by type. So I have like my mod liners here, my Tombos, my friction colors, my Stabilo fine liners, and then this one has Microns and uh, Sigma, Un no, I'm sorry, Uniball Signo. And then these are just some Crayola colored pencils, and then there's a couple other things like eraser, whiteout, stuff like that. Um, this, did I ever show a video of this? I know I posted a picture on my Instagram at one point, but this is my julep collection. This is my favorite nail polish. I'm going to go over all of these colors um, at some point in like a review video for the brand, but these are just my favorite nail polishes so that I keep them on the wall so that they're handy and I can just grab them and see what I have without having to dig around. And then um, my sewing machine is here. I have it covered with its dust cover right now, but it's a Genome... 2212, so there you go. Pretty basic, I guess, but uh, it works pretty well for what I use it for, and I definitely have to break that out really quick, or soon, because uh, I want to start making some stuff for the new baby. Um, so yeah, this shelf, my husband was nice enough to mount it up above the desk. So I already said I have my camera there. There's just some, you know, things like this is my whole this has been my bullet journal collection for the last year, two, two and a half years. Um, no, year and a half. Those are the travel ship books I own that I'm not currently using. Paper, paper cutters, and that box has all my stationery. And uh, yeah, just some little knickknacks. There we go. Um, that is a Google Cardboard that I never use. And then on the wall here, we have the poster I got from Comic-Con this year, poster I got from Comic-Con three years ago, and uh, yeah, that's pretty much what I've got here. I am really liking having all the space. I like the white that's clean and easy um, to like tell if it needs to be wiped down. I just use like a wet wipe and it's pretty easy. Oh, this chair is also from Ikea. I don't remember what it's called, but it wrote, it like spins, but it doesn't have wheels because we have carpet in here. Oh, you know what? That's what the wheels are for. It does come with wheels, but I don't have them on there. Um, and then, yeah, that's the whole setup. So I, I know some of you guys are probably wondering what that looked like. I just wanted to kind of give you a layout so that you have sort of a, an idea of what my space looks like when I'm filming. Um, thank you guys for joining me on this tour. Um, I'm going to be doing a tour of the whole house soon. I keep saying soon. Um, but you know how things are. I'd like it to look kind of nice before we do that. So um, I will see you then. And in the meantime, have a great day. And I will see you later. Bye.